My name is Gideon Mutum. Uh, I pastor the Governor's Assembly here in Kapanchan. Uh, it's a church that um, uh, is concerned about how the church can be, the universal church can be relevant in issues that uh, borders on humans and uh, society. From all the stories you've heard from the victims uh, of these attacks, you know, what do you think can be done to prevent this from recurring? I, because uh, of this interview, let me, before I answer that question, uh, it is not something that I have just gathered from the people or what I heard from the people. It is something that I also experience. You know, what is my experience in it? In the fresh, you know, event of it, some I were able to witness, some we are able to hear, and some also we have the aftermath of it. So uh, for me to answer that question, I think I need to also say what has been happening. What is the, either the root cause of it or who are the attackers in its threat and in clear terms. Now, this is a, a region that has been going through a lot of marginalization by the other side of the state, which is the northern part of the state. We've been, the attempt has been for long to conquer us. It is not something that started with our parents, something that started that have lived with our great great grandparent. It is called jihad. Uh, there was a plan to Islamize the whole of the Middle Belt, you know, and uh, Southern Kaduna inclusive. And some of our parents, our great great grandparents, resisted Usman Damfodio and uh, the political and religious phase of their advancement of Islam and what have you. So that wasn't actually possible. So if I can tell you in clear terms, historically, it is actually in the same, that same quest, that same you know, mission. It has never been slacked. It could actually go like uh, on a comma, you know, like in hibernation, you know, for a while. And I can tell you the truth, it either escalated after 10, 10 years here, or maybe an interval of five years. It has been our experience. If we are attacked, then there will be like a moment of peace. Then mobilization also will be from the enemy. Then relaunch an attack again. So we've been attacked and harassed and terrorized. That is the clear terms of it. And it is with Islamic face. It always comes with Islamic face. We've never been attacked by, with a face of armed robbery. We've never been attacked by, with a face of... Uh, um, uh, it always comes with the vehicle or in, with, a, with the face of politics and religion. That has been the ground in which we are, we are attacked. And it will always come with the division of the northern and the southern part of the state. That if something does not favor us and we rise to say no to it, even the, uh, uh, um, the, the small, minute, microscopic few of the northern region that are here will now join alliance with the northern part of the state to fight us. 